Hi guys, it's that time again. I need to pull my computer up, clean it, and I want to move. I know, mess again. I'm going to move the mixer over here so I can put that there. So I can have it come up this way. That's the plan. That's the plan. But I've got to move this, this guy first, who hasn't been out for a long, long time. I can't remember the last time this thing was up. But been a while. Been a while. So yeah, you need to uh I'm feeling really crappy today. Um need to uh sorry guys. <coughs> Just trying to get you on the tripod while I'm talking to you. What is going on here? What am I, what am I saying? Do you know what, I don't even know what I'm saying. Not a clue. Yeah, so I've sorted out the encoding on the... On the uh, OBS. And it's a lot better now to view once I've uploaded it. Okay, it's a lot better to uh, view once uploaded stuff like that, which is awesome. I am tired because I'm not going to go for it again, but um, I had to take my little boy into the hospital. Uh, yesterday, last night, we left a little after tea, I think it was six o'clock ish, and uh, I've spoken about it in the Eurotrip video that's just been uploaded. Um, but we had to take him in because of his hips, he's got a problem with his hips. Um, we didn't get back to like 1 30, I think it was, I don't know, I can't remember. Um, and then I had my daughter come wake me up at half six morning, just so she could fall back to sleep in the lounge. Which is how it normally works with her, yeah. Anyway, it's freezing in here, I've had to turn the heating up more. And uh, <coughs> we will get on and uh, computer. I know it would be more maintenance. Um. I know it'd be more maintenance, it being on the floor, because of the dust and stuff from the carpet, but... Yeah, let's just, let's just get this done. Let's just get this done. <coughs> right, I can't see if you're looking at the right way or not. Uh, not really, you can't really see. Which is nothing unusual. I mean, the dust is minging on this. Absolutely minging. Look. Oh. Ow! Actually, that will need to come out. So that will need to go back in the other side. Oh. Right, is this still attached? Yes, it is. Do not. It's always easier unplugging stuff than it is freaking putting it back in again, isn't it? Put these covers back on as well because I haven't done it since. Well, Jesus Christ, don't know how long now. I'm just gonna maybe this behaves. I won't have that the other side yet. Yeah, I mean, look at that. Look. 
upgrade and things like that. Right, let's <coughs> move around this side like this. Let's raise you up like that. And the freaking thing's broken off again. I'm getting a little sick and tired of this. It's beginning to really aggravate me. Fix right here. Can't think of an easy and a quick fix. I mean, that there would probably do. I really hate these. These are the worst bloody connectors you could possibly have on a computer. So I'm plugging on that one there, so you know I have all the room to move it if I need to, and it's just come out again. Really gone for that. Um, I'm going to take this graphics card out so uh, and give that a clean as well. If I can unplug it like that. Right, need my little handy dandy screwdriver kit. Put money on the fact that this needs a uh, cleaning off. What's that one leading to? Um, I don't know what that was leading to, you know. Oh, my hard drive, that's right, yeah. I mean, look at the back. It's covered. And it's quite well plastered in there as well. So, that is clean. I should really run my air compressor up and, uh, and uh, do it that way. As well as the Hoover, of course. Um, anyway guys, apologize. I'd love to know how this front cover comes off. Right, I'm back in a sec, I'm just gonna grab the hoover. Right, it's gonna be noisy, so I'm not gonna talk because it's just easier not to. <laughs> I 
let's try and block the move first, shall we? No, it's not actually too bad. Not too bad. Right, um, right at the front, somewhere, right down there, you can see, you can, I don't know if you can see that, I don't even see how ming it is down there, you probably can't, but I need to get there and try and hoover some of that out, it hasn't been done since I've owned this thing. <laughs> Love to take this front cover off, but I have no idea how it comes off. Not without breaking anyway. I actually have no idea. So I can't get to that fan in there that, that's behind this. But I do need to clear that off because it's a bit minging up here, no idea what it's from. Right, 
Right, wipe the bottom of their off out. I mean, like a minging that is. Don't worry, I'm not touching any of the components with the uh, wipe. Right, let's reinstall this. This needs to just chill, like over there, like that. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm ready for this cover to get back on. Just need to fix this again. Oh, I'll get out here real quickly. If you can see this or not, apologize if you can't. Let me grab some tape. I don't have any uh, electrical tape in here, so I'm just gonna use some cellar tape for the moment. stop any of the uh, ends there touching any of this that could possibly short out that's that's what it's for and it's not exactly it's that mains it's only 12 volt so that cover can go back on got the doodars in here Uh, 
and now fight to get the other side on. That's that. So that can go over there for that. Oh, I'll tell you what, my back is hurting today. Like really hurting. Oh my god, look at the cables down there. Like literally, you want to see the cables that are down there. That's me, that's all me. Right, well, need to move all this so I can uh, get to this side. This is the ethernet that's going. I know you can't see, sorry. Oh my god, there's a hell of a draft coming in there. Um, I'm just off the headphones. Like that. Let it through. Now the extension unit that's underneath here, let's uh, lay you down so I can see whether you can see what I'm on about. There we go, down on my level now. So this extension unit down here, I need to unplug and plug in right over there. Hmm. I don't think this is going to be long enough. Nope. I've got loads of stuff plugged into this. Try and sort this out. No, no, I'll be back because I don't know how I'm going to do this yet. Good morning, afternoon, afternoon now, everyone. I'm a lot better now, like more wide awake, but my room's a mess. I mean, complete mess. Let me show you. The other covers all, all smushed up because I don't know why actually. Like that, I'll explain why now. Yes, I've cleared my box out. I've got a load of stuff there that needs to go in the bin. But literally that is all that's come out that needs to go in the in the bin from, from there. So I've done a good job at uh, uh, not getting rid of much. <laughs> but nah, truthfully, I mean, I've got a ton of these cables, like a ton, that are, oh, let me turn you on, that are that sort. I've got a few. Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Right, so these ones are meant to be that. 
So I don't know why that's mixed up in it. Never mind. This one is these lot are are these sort of ones. Then I've got the auxiliary cables and jack cables and stuff like that. I could just go in. SAR cable, power cable, just phone cable. That can just all go in there. Um, that can go in. That can go in. As you can see, I've got I've got a couple of these, but I'm not sure if they all work. But I've wrapped them up just in case. That's one there needs going with that one there. They need wrapping up. And like here, uh, I've got phone cables and stuff like that. Um, printer cables and just normal aerial cables, which you may not need now, but you do if you need if you try again. You do if you're on now TV box. Uh, VGA. You do need that if you're on now TV box. It runs off normal. Um, aerial. That's another PGA, another phone. I've got filters down here somewhere. There they are. Got filters for your internet. Um, I don't know what this came with my mic. I don't know what you'd ever use this for because it doesn't power your mic. Obviously, running it through that thing there and the mixer, it, it powers your mic. Uh, this doesn't. This doesn't give out the power to power your mic. This, so I, I don't know why they even was. Don't even know why they gave you this. But if I get rid of this, I was guaranteed to go and need it or something. So it can go in the box. Um, another printer cable. I'm sure, it's like the third one. Another. Oh no, that's a S S video cable. I think it is. I think they are. Uh, Huge jack to jack. Then what size they are? Then I've got uh, USB to USB, a USB to another one of those. And of course, be right back, guys. Sorry about that, guys. Um, that's my partner because just down the road we've got a speed camera and. Uh, People, people were getting stuck there because of uh, roadworks and stuff like that and my partner just rang up to say it was a uh, Vodafone putting phone lines in. I thought it was open reach or, you know, BT that uh, put them in. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, you know what it is, you've already guessed that, haven't you? Ethernet cable. Get there eventually. Um, I haven't actually used this one yet. I don't know what it'd be like, but it's it's kind of like phone cable, but it's for your uh, I want to say it's for your router because if you have a look here, oh, okay, that that happened. If you look here, that's fairly big. It's not that size, so it's. It's the ones for your router. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? So, like, if you have a look, router, phone. Wow. Oh, getting the right way. I'll use your help. And if I bring this across, you can see I've still got that on there. I use that one there now. As you can see, I've got the other one. They're, they're both the same, so I don't know if it's like an extension. It's fairly long. So, I, I don't know. This here is. Oh, I can't remember what these are called now. These are for speakers for uh, my amp I've got in the. Uh, my amp I've got in the uh, cupboard over there for when I did discos and stuff like that. <coughs> I, used to, I used to own about three, four grand's worth of gear, disco stuff. Um, then we've got 
these are all like power power cables and stuff like that. So we've got that sort, which I don't even know what you, what you call that sort. Another one, which, yeah. Uh, got another one here, which is for monitors or, or computers. Uh, another one here that has two, so one would be for, uh, that will be for like monitors or something like that, twin monitors. And then I've got that one, which is sometimes used for laptop uh, transformers. I think they're transformers anyway. Uh, I've got another one for monitors, which these two will come in bloody handy when I've got a four set monitor set up. This one here is, this is from my disco stuff. So basically, you plug in mains there, and you have one, two, one, two, three out. So I could have that plug in three monitors if I wanted to. So just say, just say I'm gonna have a three monitor set up. Let me get rid of all this so you're not distracted. Just say, you have, just say I have a three monitor set up, I could use that one and one of these if I was to have a, a, a twin one set up. Or if I was brave enough, if you're brave enough, if, big if, I wouldn't recommend it though, you can plug your computer into it and two monitors. And then you can plug that into a UPS, which is like a backup for when you have a, have a power cut and stuff like that. Could do that, but I wouldn't recommend dragging all that power through that one cable. It depends though, I mean, if you've got just a normal computer for, uh, for, um, oh, that one is going to be, for, you know, hardly anything for just browsing them, it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, and then I've got just these things. Oh, are you going to focus? Um, I would chuck these away, but knowing my luck, as soon as I chuck them away, I'm going to need them. Oh, more, more of these as well. <coughs> that was, because it's got twin of these, like jack cables, they're actually for these walkie-talkies. Wow, focus. That's actually for these walkie-talkies. They uh, plug into the top there. These ones here have their own one here. So yeah, I've just, uh, today we had a guy in to sort our floor out, just loads of them. Oh, well, I'd love a drawer where I could put like just these in one and I move, you know, like a toolbox you move out of the way and you got wires underneath and stuff like that. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I've got to, I can go in. I've got to go out and, well, I've got to run the Ethernet cable out and stuff like that, but the only problem with that is <sighs> it keeps peeing down with rain. I'm just coming around here to uh, quickly turn the uh, dishwasher off because it keeps going off. Yeah, it, keep, it keeps hammering down with rain and, and hail. But yeah, the guy in here has just uh, done the floor. Some of our tiles were lifting up. I don't know if you can see the difference in the floor. I go along and see the older ones compared to the new ones. So I needed that back one there because it was cracked. And as you can see, the toilet leaks, as you can see. So nothing we can do about that. Had to have new ones in there. These, this one, and this one, I believe, was lifting up after we got out of the shower because the seal in there uh, leaks and it comes out. Like there. I haven't had a chance to fix in here. I haven't had a chance to fix in here yet because of everything else going wrong. But then again, I, this whole bathroom, right, there's, there's eight flats here and there's eight flats the other side. Every single one of these flats suffers with damp in the exact same places, even across there. And every single bathroom in, in these places two flats so far, no, four flats so far, I've had to, the whole bathrooms have been ripped out and redone. And it's the same for in here. Our, our bathroom needs doing as well. Like, Matey's just come in there. He's going to Jamie's next door now. 
and uh, he said, <sighs> could they have Jamie and Brandon have problems with the drainage in their bath, and uh, he said they will uh, go through the lounge wall because it's cheaper to fix that than it is to rip the bath out because this bath isn't got like the normal siding on where you can take it out and have a look. Of course it hasn't. It's got tiles on the side of the bath. Don't get me wrong, I'd have that over any day over um, the flimsy, crappy, you know, the, what's it what's it called that goes to the side of the uh goes on the side of the uh, baths and stuff like that. I, I, it's really flimsy but I'd rather have tiles any day and have to take those tiles out or maybe replace them only problem with those tiles is they don't do them anymore these flats are seven years old I think and they don't do those tiles anymore so the tiles that makes put in are probably about half inch all the way along too small and Sophie's like oh that looks horrible that looks horrible now well, yeah, for one, you're you're looking at it. You you know you know what's wrong. So, of course, it's gonna look horrible. Two, you look at it before it's finished. I mean, bear in mind these tiles are different. Back and forth, back and forth. Bear in mind these tiles are different. I don't think they're too bad matching in. Our tiles here kind of have a have a pattern. If you have a look, these ones here don't have anything so we got we got pan nothing so then we, if you see here yeah. so it used to be really noticeable before it was all growled in and stuff like that which expected and you expect the colors to be ridiculously different but truthfully I don't think it's that bad but mate he's just said <laughs> Bear in mind, I have kids. I have kids, yeah? I have kids. My son climbs onto the toilet from the side. He comes on from the one side he's not allowed to stand, which is that side. We've been told he non, not to try and not walk on that tile. Try and not walk on these ones. Perfect example. Who walks on these ones anyway? I stand here, okay? I stand there. I don't ever touch those tiles. But to not walk on these, it's right in the frickin' middle. And what if the whole floor was done? If the whole floor was done, what are we meant to do? Put a ladder over to the toilet? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I bet you guys haven't seen a cable like this for a long while. I had this in this box. Yes, I still have one. It's in the bin now though. And this is what I've been dealing with all day. Rain and hail. Yay. So, um, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to get around to doing that Ethernet cable. Or I have no clue when I'm going to get around to doing it. Because I have to clear everything out of the shed. So I can get to the bottom corner. I also have to move my computer and stuff out again because, you know, I've moved it all now. If you are, uh, you see, my desk is a, a little tidier, just a little bit. So I'm moving my computer down there. And the good thing about how my computer down there is the holes right there. I've got fans on the side of my computer. Cold air, sweet. I've moved my mic there, as you can see. So when I'm I'm kind of like that, so I'm front on like that. So let me uh, take this off and I'll show you. So let's go to preview. So I'm going to be something like that. Um, maybe, maybe a little higher. So as you can see. It fits here quite nicely, and it's not coming over anymore, as you can see. So, you have to see yourself here. Oh, wrong way. There.
so that is that's how that's worked. Of course, it looks like it's right on my face now, doesn't it? But it's it's actually not. Look, it's just the angle. See, I'm actually well away from it. I'm not too far. I'm not too close to it. Sorry. Here, it looks like it's right on my face. But it packs away neatly down there. Holds in and packs away neatly. So, bonus. But I think, guys, that is it. I think because Christ, I can't remember what, what I recorded yesterday. Um, I've just got these few cables to pick up, <sighs> and that is it. Oh, excuse me. I'm knackered. Um. Yeah, look. So I won't be out there today. But anyway, guys, I think that is it. Um, I haven't really got anything else planned. I didn't really think today through, to be fair. Um. Yeah, I think that's it. And fingers crossed soon, hopefully we can get that Ethernet cable outside. Hopefully. I'm thinking of maybe just running it up along the outside of the shed and att attaching it to the drain pipe, maybe. So I can get up nice and high. Same with the... Uh, um, what should we call it? CCTV stuff, so I can get up nice and high. So that moment is it's going up high, but it's coming down real, real low. It's like right down here, and you can strangle yourself on it. But yeah, I think that's it, guys. I think that's it. I think. Can't think of anything else. So I'm guessing that is it. So thanks ever so much for watching, guys. I thought something popped in my head then, but it was nothing, it was a fake. But thanks ever so much for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.